Okay, so we are back inside the KISS Sandwich Showcase. We have another sandwich that we're whipping up for you this morning. I have Zach Mustafa, Foodie Tales with Zach, a big foodie yes. around town, and he is sorting up some... Fish, some white fish fillets. Mm. So I'm going to make today, well, it's actually quite done. So I'm just gonna so take this ready. off. Yes, we are ready. So that's white fish? So this is white fish so fillets. Tilapia or just like, just like white fish? Um, I know it as white fish. White fish. And the store I bought it from yeah. it said white fish. White fish, so you stick it with white uh, fish. White fish. Right, white fish. <laughs> it's, um, it's similar to tilapia. Um, I enjoy it quite well. Yeah, nice, My, nice, nice flaky fish. It's good for sandwiches. Yes, yes. it's good excellent for sandwiches. for sandwiches. Yeah, yeah. So I'm gonna have my bread toasted. I wanna toast the inside just really, really quickly. Right. Toasting bread is important. Yes. And these buns, uh, by these kids. buns are these good buns. Uh, was that very, very good. Yeah, yeah, nice healthy buns. It's the uh, it's, uh, healthy uh, balanced jumbo buns, guys. And Zach is using these buns to make a, a fish sandwich. And tell us, Zach, what 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 you're doing? So today I made a shadow benny chimichurri. Right. And I made a garlic, lemon, and olive. So it's quite a mouthful. Um, aioli. Mm -hmm. So it's a little experiment. I was trying to get ingredients that you, you would probably have at home already. Right. You don't have to go out to the grocery um, to get anything, maybe the fish. Right. It's Lent season, but most people already have fish in T stock. Tell me about the chimichurri. I mean, so people, the chimichurri yeah. is, I, I made this with mainly shadow benny, parsley, some sive or mm -hmm. chives, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, garlic, um, a little bit of lemon juice and some olive, olive oil, oil, olive yes, oil, and, olive oil. Yeah. And, 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 and just, just mix up. Just mix up, um, season with a little bit of salt yeah. and black pepper. Yeah. And yeah, it, it tastes wonderful. Mm. It complements the fish very, very well. Yeah, yeah. And then you have the garlic aioli, which is garlic sauce, mayonnaise, a little bit of lemon juice as well. And then I did some, to add a little bit of salt to it, I added some um, olives some finely chopped olives. So you get um, those little nice bursts of, of saltiness with the fish as well. Yeah, some Mediterranean flavors yeah. kind of thing there as well. And yeah, you have to have something like this with fish. It complements it ex very, very well. My mouth is watering, brother. Yes. Um, check your buns. So let's head check back to the buns. <laughs> <laughs> check your buns because uh, we need to put this sandwich together. Uh, we want to thank the folks at Kiss Baking Company for making it possible. Uh, check out their new healthy uh, balance buns. This big, cool, green buns on the market, guys, and Zach, yes. Zach buns. It's all toasted and ready. Right. And he's gonna put together this fish sandwich. So. Another one that you can try at home. Zach will leave the recipe and you can try it on trinicooks.com. Yes, I will. So, we're gonna plate our fish. Now, um, I know usually people sometimes put it on the sandwich. I like to put it on the fish itself, because I find the chimichurri I usually spread uh, the garlic on the top. On the fish itself? Well, the garlic goes on the, um, on the bread. Right. And then the chimichurri I put on the fish itself. Right, right. So I'm just gonna layer my fish. You do your magic. You want enough fish so that complements the bread. I love And you don't want I to bite in just the bread. You want to, exactly. Yes, you want to get some nice fish. You have some you nice there. fish there. There we go. I'll take some of the garlic sauce. Just use the back end of the spoon. Yeah, the back end of the spoon, actually. Yeah. Yes. Not too much, just enough to, because you have the garlic and you have a lot of flavors. These flavors, yeah. So flavors you don't want to put too much. Right. And strong flavors at that. So yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Just wanted to compliment it. I understand. And then you're putting, you're putting that on the fish directly. On the fish, yes. On the fish directly. Chimichurri on the fish directly. Just. So I think last week Chef Cheryl would have done a shadow benny using a shadow benny. Yes. Pesto. So you're doing you're doing a shadow benny chimichurri. Chimichurri, correct. It's a little bit different. Yeah. But um, the main benny. star is shadow benny. Now I like a lot of shadow benny. You do. I love a lot of. So that's why you see me slathering yes, this. Yes, I just. But we also uh, have a lot of fish. Right. So you don't want to also get lost. <laughs> right. Very well. <laughs> there we go. Let's not overdo it today. <laughs> So we do some tomatoes. Got good tomatoes this morning. Fresh, baby. lovely yeah, fresh tomatoes. Lovely fresh tomatoes this Slice morning. Of tomatoes and yeah, 
A. Don't waste. Don't waste. <laughs> Lettuce is expensive. Lettuce is expensive. <laughs> oh. Well, this is called now called an upside down fish sandwich. Nice. Now we try it <laughs> So we're gonna cut into this here. See. There you go. Beautiful fish, chimichurri, garlic aioli sandwich. Right, Joel? That, so, that looks good, man. That looks and good. You. It's amazing the things you can do with two pieces of bread. Huh? It is. Yeah, yeah. The Cheers. Flavor. Cheers, man. The I'm just watching, I always like to watch the flavor. You're seeing the chimichurri, uh, the aioli, tomatoes, lettuce. Full works. Full works. Let's go. Cheers. Mm. So balance of flavor is important. Mm -hmm. Now I thought the creaminess of the aioli kind of just really balance of the strong flavor mm -hmm. of the of the chimichurri, the chimichurri. Mm -hmm. especially with the shadow mm -hmm. Benny. Mm. This fresh. is very good. And that's the fresh was cooked on nice crispy edges, so you get that crispy balance in there as well. The white fish, I think, is important. Fish. It's a good fish to use with mm -hmm. it as well. It nice, is. flaky, nice, light, flaky fish. Light fish bite yeah. into it, easy. Mm -hmm. And this is the perfect bun. Perfect bun. The perfect bun. Uh, guys, try the recipe on trinicooks.com. Zach did uh, what he is calling uh, a fish sandwich with a shadow belly, chimichurri, and uh, lemon garlic aioli. This is a good one. We want to thank the folks at KISS for making it possible. This is the KISS Sandwich Showcase every Saturday here on the show. We're coming right back. I want to thank Zach for making it possible here, making this wonderful sandwich. Check him out, Foodie Tales with Zach, one of the food bloggers out on town, in and around, all about, all over the place. Everywhere. Everywhere, everywhere, everywhere. everywhere. Thanks a lot, Zach. No problem, yeah, thank you, Joel. Mm-hmm.